Well, good morning, everybody. Actually, sitting in Princeton, Indiana, by the tracks. So I'll go ahead and narrate this. So the Chessie train has just left to go back to Chalkathy. So the Ohio switcher moves past the swamp, and we're going to start shuffling cars. First thing we have to do, though, is get out of the way of the dt and train that's coming through. We're going to pull the switcher onto the uh, Ohio Fire Brick track just to get him out of the way. Got a couple of box cars for bagged clay and uh, some empty hoppers for bulk clay. All right, now that he's gone, we can uh, get the engine out of the siding and go back to uh, switch Charrington scrap. The empty gondolas on the end of the train. Might as well take advantage of it and go ahead and knock that out today. But the uh, train is blocking the switch, so we're going to have to push the uh, train up on the other side of Route 93 while we do the switching. So let's leave those two boxcars there. I'll bring the rest of it back.
pretty warm day down here in Princeton. Sitting in the shade. I've got the windows rolled most of the way up in the car. Uh, mosquitoes were trying to get me. We're going to pull the loaded car. I appreciate the uh, suggestions and ideas I've gotten for the little um, electric switcher that I got as a present. Uh, nothing's going to happen real soon on that. Uh, I really want to, when I get back from all these travels, I want to focus on getting some more scenery done in the yard uh, and getting standard ele elevator uh, incorporated into my operations. It'll be a pretty simple uh, video this week, kind of short. That's why I put the DT and I run through train in. So when I get home Friday, and then on Saturday, I'm going to try to film three videos for the next three weeks since I'll be in Mexico. Um, hopefully, my phone storage will hold them, and I'll just post them on those Saturdays. Somebody asked me what the uh, OHI stood for on the Alco Switcher. And so I do have a lot of new subscribers. So it stands for Oak Hill Industrial. And it's just a fictional railroad that I made up. In my mind, the three remaining industries in Oak Hill uh, bought the trackage so they could uh, keep getting service. And bought this old Alco Switcher that they keep in... Ohio fire brick uh, when they're not using it. In reality, Chessie switched this until they sold the entire line to the city of Jackson and had various operators throughout the year, but now the trackage in Oak Hill is essentially abandoned, even though it's technically not abandoned. There hasn't been a train there over 10 years. All right, that'll do it for this video. Hope everybody enjoyed it. Everybody stay safe, and I will see you next Saturday.